Good morning. Welcome to another daily devotional thought from Fairview Lutheran Church. As we look at 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, uh, piece by piece throughout the week, if you join us on uh, our weekend worship time Saturday at 5 o'clock or Sunday at 9 a.m., uh, you'll be um, you can be part of a Bible study that looks at these a little bit more with a little more depth and with your thoughts and, and your your faith involved in that conversation. So please uh, come join us this weekend for worship and then following worship, a study of God's word from 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verses 13 to 18. Uh, the last two verses are, are words that, that are part of the comfort that God gives us about our final resting place. That it won't be in the grave. Uh, it won't be a, a place where we just go back to dust and where the uh, creatures of earth get to devour our bodies, but rather it's heaven. Because in the end, what Christ reminds us, those who died will rise first. After that, then those who are alive will meet them in the cloud. It says so in verse 17. After that, we who are still alive and are left will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. Think about that moment when you get to meet the Lord. You already know him, uh, and you trust him, and you believe in him. You, you've read his story time and time again. You've heard about what he's done, but then to get to meet him face to face, that's the one of the joys and beauties of heaven. You get to meet the Lord. And it's not going to be just for a time. It's not going to be a, a quick meeting where we meet him and then we're done. We meet him and then we're with him forever in heaven. And so, we will be with the Lord forever. These are words that Paul gives to the people of Thessalonica who are new to the faith and are new to this understanding of, of heaven being a place where God is, not where we have to achieve to get to, but that God gives us freely. And so I encourage you, as Paul encourages them, Look forward to that wonderful, blessed day where Christ returns, the trumpet blast, and the dead will rise first. After that, those who are alive will meet him in heaven, there to live forever with the Lord. May God bless you as you look forward to that day, for that eternity. In Christ's name we pray. Amen.